our way to Carmel. Hi, I would like a two small caramel ice coffees. Yay! Oh, thank you. Thank you, Hagrid. Thank you. You too. McDonald's ice coffee is way better than Starbucks. You heard it here first. Cheers! Cheers. Mm. What you making over here? Eggs. We are going to Gold's Gym in Monterey, California. Today, start the day off right. To kick off this workout, I ran a mile on the treadmill and then I hopped on the Smith machine. I put 25 pounds on each side and I started to do squats, wide leg squats. I did 15 reps and I made sure to really focus on squeezing my glutes at the top in each and every rep. The weight you use should be difficult but it definitely shouldn't be really hard as this is kind of a warm up exercise. After that I'm moving right into lunges. I'm doing 12 reps on each leg and I'm making sure I kick my leg up and really squeeze my glute at the top as well. This is a really awesome workout and it will get those glutes pumping and ready to go. Next exercise I'm doing with very little rest in between is a squat into a shoulder press. So you definitely want to squeeze your glutes tight at the top, but not only that, you're now grabbing two dumbbells and shooting your arms up over your head to get a really intense, abrupt movement. This is really great to work all over your body and is a real killer. So three sets of these 12 times. Moving right into deadlifts, love deadlifts. It's a great all over body exercise as well, but it's really good for your glutes. The first thing I do when I do deadlifts is I warm up with no weight to really get my form down. I look in the mirror, I make sure that my back is straight and everything looks good and then I add my weight. I'm adding 25 pounds on each side because this is a weight that really works for me. I'm able to get a great workout in, I'm sweating, I'm trying really hard but I'm also not killing myself. The goal on my deadlifts was trying to make the last three reps very, very difficult. So I did 12 reps, three different sets, and I was struggling the last three of the reps, and that is the goal. Remember while deadlifting to breathe at the top. That will help you get through it so much. Make sure you're tightening your core, and this will be one of the most effective workouts you can do. Third exercise of this workout is going to be donkey kicks on the Smith machine. I added 10 pounds on each side. I'm bringing one of my legs underneath the Smith machine and I'm pushing up and squeezing my butt at the top to really get a nice glute exercise in. This will plump up the booty, so if that's what you're trying to do, try this and really Concentrate on mind muscle connection and squeezing your glue at the top. I did 12 reps on each leg. It's important for me to always get ab workouts in my workout, so Kelsey made up a little circuit to do. We started with Russian twists with a medicine ball. We did 15 reps. It's a bounce on one side and bounce on the other is one rep. And then we went for the next exercise into toe touches for 15 reps. These are hard. If you need to take a break, take a break and jump right into it. Make sure that you're squeezing your core very, very tight and getting the most out of each movement. I'm telling you, it's not easy, but get through the 15 reps, move on. It's not a rush. You don't need to do them quickly. Take your time and you will get the most out of it. All right, so we just finished working out at Gold's Gym. We had an awesome workout, what would you say? Uh, totally. Yeah. Yeah. So now we're gonna go home, we're gonna get something to eat, and then we're gonna have a super fun day. Gonna go to the beach, right guys? That's what the plan is. It's a beautiful day in the bay. Follow us there.
and be like, oh, shower. Hey, can you put the chat on my bed and keep top real quick? Go ahead. Sure. Hey, so we're on our way to the beach. We're ready. Let's go. Woo! from the ocean tide and I, I feel so alive we take it easy take our time we're living sweet in this salty life and I, I feel so alive we're all just riding the way 